Duty with a security alert team is one of the several assignments available to a missile guardian. The job starts when a team is assigned a 48-hour tour at the launch control facility. The SAT team member is issued his M16 weapon in 54 rounds. The team leader is issued the necessary sidearms. The alert team stands regular guard mount with other security police going on duty. then transported to the launch control facility where they're assigned their patrol vehicle. During their 48-hour tour at the control facility, the team patrols each of the 10 missile launch sites on a prescribed basis, during which they carefully check security conditions. However, when on standby between patrols and alarm response, they may read, watch TV, or study as the urge demands. Between duty shifts, the alert teams sleep in rooms at the launch control facility. Actually, they constitute a reserve force, should the need arise. At each of the launch control facilities, there's always a cook on duty, ready to prepare a wide selection of hot meals from the excellent menu. But when responding to a penetration alarm, it's all security duty. It's important that the alert team make sure of the cause of the alarm and check the overall conditions at the launch site. If their investigation reveals a hostile act, the alert team must use the minimum force necessary to protect the missile. And furthermore, under no conditions can they terminate the security response until authorized by the combat crew. However, when unforeseen events requires that the alert team must protect the launch facility for an extended length of time, security operations at the base has provisions for relieving the team within a reasonable time. 